freshman year, you've chosen electrical engineering because you liked math, the pay was good, and you've always had a thing for wizardry. Your schedule fills up with math, math and more math. So if that doesn't thrill you, you might be better off in industrial engineering. Sophomore year kicks off with digital logic circuits, fundamentals of engineering mechanics, electrical circuit analysis, computer systems, and another truckload of math. You spend more time than you care to admit wondering why your circuits won't work, only to discover you plug your diode in backwards. Junior year, after more than enough experience with loose connections, a key learning this year is that sometimes breadboards just need a little pat to start working. Junior year is a caffeine-fueled haze of signals and RF systems, digital electronics, applied electromagnetics, electric power engineering, wireless communications, control systems, analog electronics, and random signals and systems. Although you learn endless mathematical theories, there's nothing you can't do with Laplace transforms. Senior year, you've almost made it, but not before thermodynamics and heat transfer, a handful of technical electives, and finally, senior design. You're ready for a career in power, electronic controls, component manufacturing, instrumentation, or if all else fails, software.